I'm here in front of the office of the anti-Semitic liar Congresswoman Rashida Tlaib, the same Rashida Tlaib that refuses to condemn the terrorist organization Hamas, the same Rashida Tlaib that refuses and turned a blind eye on the atrocities that Hamas committed on the 7th of October. Yes, they killed Israelis, they burned them, they raped our women, they kidnapped our kids, they kidnapped the elderly, the sick. Those kids were kidnapped by Hamas. And Rashida Talib doesn't say anything, anything, seriously. So here, I'm putting the flyer for her in order to make sure that she doesn't forget that we have kidnapped Israelis in Gaza, kidnapped by Hamas. And if English doesn't shock her and make her change her mind, maybe the Arabic one will make her change her mind. Rashida Talib, stop being a hypocrite, stop lying. Call for the immediate release of the babies and for the immediate release of every hostage kidnapped by the terrorist organization Hamas. This is the right thing to do. If you want to free the Palestinians, free the Palestinians from the terrorist organization Hamas. Oh, and by the way, Rashida Talib, you should be also ashamed. Until today, you haven't deleted your tweet about the hospital. Until today, people who follow you think that Israel bombed the hospital and killed 500 Palestinians. Well, the truth that you know it was the Islamic Jihad. Shame on you, Rashida Talib. Shame on you. I really hope she doesn't take this down. Unbelievable. So you see, as expected, they took the flyers down and literally five minutes gone. Five minutes. This is just shows you exactly who Rashida Tlaib is. Here, this is what Rashida Tlaib stands for. Stands for hypocrisy, stands for literally supporting terrorism. Wallahi, shame on you. Shame on you, Rashida Tlaib. Kids kidnapped by terrorist organization Hamas and you take it down almost immediately. You didn't even hold it for five minutes. Shame on you, Rashida Tlaib. Shame on you.